Okay, so Pisces, let's see what the partner want to tell you because the hidden secrets was interesting as well as the Pisces reading. We had a soulmate, but I'm just confused at what is going on and why the soulmate is going through pain or something like that. Um, so let's see, Pisces. Someone was asking me for Pisces. You got the four of pentacles. Uh, what do Pisces partner? I want to really shuffle. So what do Pisces partner want to tell Pisces? Pisces partner. Pisces partner. Whoa. That's the eight of wands. Your partner is locked into that cage. Their heart is locked in there. Um, they want to message you. Let's see. Pisces partner. The same card as the hidden secret. So let's see if it's the same. The death card is here. Pisces partner. King of swords. A crazy be Gemini. Someone can have air in the chart. Okay. As well as Scorpio. Pisces partner. And then here's the soulmate again. Came out. I can't even make that up. The Hierophant, Marriage, and the Ace of Cups. We're not reading reversals today. So you have the soulmate, the Hierophant, Marriage. Your partner see you as marriage material or you see them as marriage material. But something or someone is in the way of this love connection. We also have the Five of Cups, so someone could have walked away, okay? Um, didn't value you enough in this connection, Pisces. Or maybe you had to make the choice to walk away from this connection. Alright, so someone had to um, make the ultimate choice to dead this connection, or someone wants to rebirth after a dead or quiet period um someone might be laying in regret with this three of cups three cups is spilled this person don't see the other two cups uh what's the pisces partner the princess of wands this is the page of wands page of wands is young energy page uh passion aries el sage a lot of sexual passion. The Pisces partner is the high priestess. Flew across the room. Listening to your intuition. You could be dealing with someone with the Pisces in the chart. Or um, who is the sun sign Pisces or Aries. I mean Aquarius. I mean. <laughs> sun, moon, rising and Venus in Pisces. All right. Someone could be closed off. This is what your partner want to tell you or you are. You have the last card that came out is temperance. Healing. Someone is having patience. And then you have healing again. The sun. So someone could be physically trying to heal. Um, or mentally with this nine of swords. Having sleepless nights. Alright. Insomnia. Mental imbalance. Maybe um, bipolar, schizophrenia type of energy. Alright. But uh, this person, your partner, I want to tell you that uh, they do miss you and dear, dearly. Okay. But they are confused. Two of swords. Don't know what to do. Don't trust this connection. Um, who is the eight of wands for the partner want to tell? And then we're going to extend it. You have the magician, the high priestess again. The partner don't trust you. Five of swords, a page of wands, a magician, five of coins, and a two of swords. So something they clearly can't see or refusing to see. All right. An apology. They need to apologize if they falsely accused you of something, Pisces. Yeah, here's this page of cups jumped on top of the sun. If they accused you of something, of some type of health or infidelity type of issue, they need to apologize, period. This could be another Pisces or someone with Pisces in the chart. Here's the Hierophant, Taurus, accusing you of being married here. 
the Hierophant. Um, accusing you all types of things. That's their insecurity, not yours. We're going to shuffle again, but let's go into the extended. Alright, so this is the extended. Eight of Wands again. Oh my God, two of Cups. <laughs> and it flew literally Eight of Wands again. Okay, two of Cups came out. Your partner is a soulmate, but the soulmate is insecure and going through some type of mental imbalance that you can't fix. The heart is locked in a cage. You can't you can't release it. It needs to release 